Hello everyone, Albert here and welcome back to another speed build in The Sims 4. We are continuing our tiny Willow Creek series here and this is the second one in this neighborhood or actually the third I believe. So in the last time we did the uh, BFF household, we're just taking a look at the starter house that we have here. So this is the uh, Creek Cabana which is actually at the end of this street. Um, this is probably the starter house that I pick the most when starting out in Willow Creek. I really like the positioning. The lot is small, but it has a good positioning. Uh, the house is actually fairly good, but I wanted to, and you know, put my little uh, tiny new crest stamp on it. So this time around, we have created a micro home. Um, a micro home is the smallest of the houses that you can get so this is only 32 tiles it is a starter house so it's actually under so the original house was uh about 13 and a half thousand simoleons with the lot um the house that i built here is under 15,000 with the lot so about 13,000 something without the lot size uh, so it's a fairly cheap house it's a good sized house for a micro home it has everything that you need and i really try to make it look you know nice and inviting again this is also a base game plus house like we did with the bff household um, because I thought that was a really cool challenge and I really wanted to do that again. So again, we're only using base game and the tiny house uh, or tiny living stuff pack for this house. So it turned out really nice. I'm really overall really pleased with how it looked uh, and how it turned out. Again, doing a micro home is actually fairly difficult in this game um, because we have a lot of items that actually takes up a lot of space because your sim is going to have to be able to use the stuff that they are gonna use so for example a a stovetop actually needs two tiles even though it only fits on one tile it needs a tile in front of it for your sim to actually be able to use it so it actually a lot of items takes up a lot of space uh, a bit more space than you actually realize i had some problems with the game here when it lagged like crazy uh, the windows didn't want to be put in uh, in the right places I couldn't change the wallpaper so I actually had to close down the game and start it up again I don't know if any of you guys have had any problems with this it's just uh, it's a an annoying little uh, little bug I believe um, going into the build here we are starting the layout I thought that since this is a micro home and since we have a bit more uh, or a bit less space to actually work with um, doing a micro home this way that I'm doing it with a um, bathroom quotation marks um, the way that it's open was probably the best way to do it we could have put in a doorway but that would just have looked very wonky I also needed this to be a starter house so I couldn't choose the best uh, items you can always upgrade this build you know once your sim actually makes some more money because this is the perfect place for your sim to actually do those types of things i believe that when micro houses uh, are enabled and you have a micro home uh, you actually earn uh, skills faster and there's a ton of these small uh, perks with having a micro house so the the smaller the house is the more perks and the bigger it gets in the tiny house uh, scale uh, the less perks you get so this is a micro house and you get a lot of perks by actually being a micro house but we actually had um, the bathroom opened up like that i thought that was the best way to do it i didn't put it in a sink uh, because you would have to go out into uh, the kitchen to use the sink but that's also something that i've seen a lot if you follow uh, the youtube channel called tiny uh, house living or big houses tiny living or something like that um, often you'd see that in the bathroom there's only just a toilet and a shower and nothing else out there because it takes up a lot of space but i actually have a fairly big uh toilet area um compared to to what i've seen uh the exterior is fairly simple again this is a starter house 
under 15,000 simoleons. So I didn't want to do too much. I still wanted you to have a lot of money uh, left over for yourself. So you could put in uh, whatever stuff you would need. Um, like an easel or something that maybe build your skills would be really cool. I put in a little seating area outside here. Just like a little porch area. Um, and the last thing we're actually going to do is put in some plants. So again, it's a fairly quick build. Doing a micro house is not that time consuming. I just wanted to get it built out and I thought doing a micro house was really funny. Like, uh, if we had some more money, we could have spent a bit more uh, a bit more time on it uh, and you know on the detailing but you can kind of see here we have the BFF house we're flowing through one of the other tiny houses in Tiny Willow Creek those two other houses you saw is actually going to be deleted because I believe originally those are um, those are uh, empty lots or at least one of them is empty as far as I remember but here we have the tiny house this build is available on the gallery right now so you can just search my origin ID which is Aubrey and you should be able to find every single thing that I have built or you can follow the link in the description box down below to this particular build um, on the browser page of the gallery while you're down there why not check me out on all the social media pages linked down there it really helps me out a great big deal and that's the best way for you to figure out when I live stream when new uploads are coming and what else I'm I'm doing so we actually have a plan to live stream plan for this week as well so definitely stay tuned for that but again social media pages linked down below like this video uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and uh, leave me a comment down below what you thought about the build this nice little cute micro home but that's it for me guys i really hope you have a fantastic day wherever you're in the world and thank you so much for watching stay safe out there and i'll see you next time for another video Bye.